Yeah, real man get it done. Yeah. So our family loves cilantro. Um, at least my wife and I really do. The kids, they tolerate it, I would say. Um, and we like to try to duplicate the uh, lime rice that's from Chipotle. And so I always buy cilantro and it ends up sucking because once um, we use it, you know, you buy a big bundle, it's really cheap, a dollar or two, and then it goes in the refrigerator and ends up going bad. Uh, definitely try freezing it. Cilantro is not a, a, a vegetable or a, a, a herb, I should say, that that's, uh, does well frozen. Um, so I was looking online and researching and just trying to see what would it take to make cilantro and make it into the dry form. Uh, so I said I would duplicate it and see how it turns out. But I have nothing to lose. I mean, it's been like a dollar forty, I think, on this parsley, not parsley, cilantro that was on sale. And I got this huge bushel that I'm kind of taking as much of the stems, uh, I guess the, the least off as possible, not doing anything perfect, but just trying to, you know, I guess make a benefit of all this cilantro that we bought and to cook it down. Now, some of the instructions that I was reading online say to put cilantro, uh, lightly coat a, a pan and put it in the oven for like 30 minutes. Um, I just think that's a lot. So I'm gonna err on the side of caution and put this in here for still maybe around that time, but I'm just starting my, my, my temperature really low. Um, I started my oven already, it's on just 170. I have a few more chores I'm doing this evening, so I'm just gonna kind of go and check on it, see how it, it'll turn out. And see what we come up with, see if we can save a little money and find us a new way of doing parsley. He called it parsley, cilantro, cilantro, cilantro. The same thing probably could be done for parsley as well. Let's we'll see how it's coming out. Let's see how it goes.
thing came out pretty good. So I am going to, it's still hot. I'm try to get this off and put this on a, not a baking sheet, just maybe a, a plate and then try to just cut it up. And I have a couple extra, I just keep them around. Um, you know, when the seasoning is done, just for me making rubs and things like that. So I'm gonna use one of these and put the cilantro in. And probably leave it out, maybe with the cap open to see overnight if it'll dry a little bit more. But I think I think we're doing pretty good. Still kind of hot, but I think it'll be just right on the cutting board. I mean, for being my first time, I'm happy how it's coming out because, as I said, we love cilantro and using it, so it helps me so I don't have to waste. So much cilantro. I was just buying it fresh from the store. crunchy a few a few um moist pieces still in there but like i said hopefully it's really dry with the cap off overnight it'll be good but um but yeah i'm happy i'm really happy with the results to see how it is first go around doing it and so this week as i make my rice bowls for lunch should be able to use my cilantro and my rice. Everything is all clean, the counters are all clean, so I can just scrape this up right into my little season maker, and then from there, wipe the counters off and I'll be done. So again, roughly, real talk, when it's all said and done, um, probably about a 45 minute to do. As I said, I, I paced myself because I didn't really want to make sure I make sure I didn't mess anything up or burn it and stuff. So, you know, I did 25 minutes, put it in my another 15 minutes or such. But um, I think if I go do this next time, I will be prepared to just keep it in for the full time, uh, keep the heat up, go ahead and let it dry itself out a little bit quicker. Um, and it really should just be like a 25 minute type of job. But again, you know, this is, five ounces, it's almost full, you know, give or take, roughly. And, you know, at the store, this would easily be, you know, I would say anywhere from five to $10, probably with how much I have in here, just being honest. So to only spend like a dollar and some change on cilantro and get that much, I definitely think that's a, a win. Good. I'm gonna leave this out just right actually near the uh, the 
the stove just so it can dry out hopefully a little bit more um, overnight. And uh, we're pretty much done. So that's about it. Again, I love just trying to save money for my family and I love, you know, trying stuff on uh, Pinterest or things I see online. So I, I like this recipe of doing cilantro. I think that's really cool and um, definitely a money saver. So definitely gonna keep using it because uh, we do love our rice bowls and um, I love them in particular just in work, for work because they're quick and easy and um, just full of protein and everything just kind of duplicating our chipotle kind of bowls. So. I think that's it. Till next time.